busy week in Washington brings to the White House Ethiopian Emperor Haile Selassie for his first meeting with President Kennedy. The 72-year-old Lion of Judah said the opportunity to meet the young American president was the main reason for his visit to this country. He is to visit Congress and the United Nations before returning to his native land. Later, President Kennedy signs with pleasure a bill that gives a $1 billion, $200 million pay raise to members of the armed forces. Servicemen got their last raise in 1958. This one averages about 14% boost for everyone but enlisted men in their first two years of service. Then President Kennedy confers with the team he had sent to Vietnam, General Maxwell Taylor and Defense Secretary McNamara. From their report, the White House announces that the war there should be successfully concluded by 1965, but warns the political picture is still gray. 